Hey everyone, Jeff here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing another Death Must Die run, and I was going after something specific, but it kind of morphed into this um, insane run, like one of the craziest I've ever had, and uh, it deserved its own kind of intro. So, if you end up liking this video and you want to support the channel, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that YouTube jazz, and I really hope you guys enjoy it, and here we go. Hey there, everyone. This is not the run I intended to do, but you know what? Who am I to turn down first pick Gehenna, second pick Warp Strike, third pick Taste of Time? Um, <laughs> you know what? Let's just do it. Uh, this is going to be silly. So uh, with gear, what we have going on here is an OK amount of XP gain. Um, I would like more if I was going for like high level since we did just get Gehenna and Taste of Time, which is like an insane synergy. If you don't know what that is, um, if you're new to the game, welcome. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Um, Gehenna gives you experience every time you deal an instance of damage. Um, taste of time makes enemies lose 6% HP per second. It's pretty good. Pretty good combo. We have inscription. I was going to do a spell area build. So that's why we have this on. So maybe we can mess with something and like make this kind of relevant. But otherwise, we're looking at a fairly low defense, high offense build with lots of XP gain and a ton of offers. So this should be a this should be a run is what I will say. <laughs> a fairly ridiculous run. We aren't using infinite pull range, I would say, is the downside. Oh, OK, well, you know, I feel like Frost Dragon is relatively appropriate given what we're doing. You know, 44 seconds in and we have three legendaries. Um, this is not what I'm after here. I see what I want in Master Winter Tide. Okay, well, you know what? Maybe we'll just get it all. If I can get, look, what I was going for was Master Winter Tide and Master Vortex to make uh, massive, like super massive black holes. Uh, I'm, I'll still do another video on that. And Star, no, I won't. Okay, we'll just do it all at once. That's fine. Um, okay, yeah, we're gonna make. Uh, gigantic black holes and we're gonna get all the XP in the world you know sometimes sometimes everything just works out <laughs> this is gonna be ridiculous now we do have summer here so what do we want to do with summer vehemence is obviously fine flare is whatever we don't really like our luck situation isn't great Honestly, Meteor is kind of funny. Like, it's not bad. I don't think I actually want Flare here. Probably want Vehemence, but not right now. And I don't think I want Breath of Fire, but maybe. Maybe level one Breath of Fire to apply. Basically, we want to apply burning, right? Um, for extra damage ticks. All right, time. What do you have for me? Um, easy vortex level up. Uh, it does increase the size. So uh, the whole joke here is that we're going to pick up every spell area increase we can throughout the run and have like huge stuff. And eventually, by eventually, I mean, we will just do it now. We're going to take alteration ritual so that we're going to have massive like everything and it's going to clutter the screen and it's going to be an event. Um. Uh, Combust might break thing. I'm gonna banish Breast of the Fire because I don't want to see it. We can reroll here. I think we could take Novice Meteor Shower. It's weird taking a Novice skill, but you know, it's, it's probably fine. Um, we do, like I said, we're using extra spell projectile uh, rune. And the only reason we're using extra spell projectile is because I wanted the extra dash. <laughs> um okay yeah i guess so i mean look sometimes the game just gives you everything it's been a bit since i made a video so maybe th like that's why but 
sometimes the game just does offer you everything. Now, I will say we only have 45 max HP, so if I get hit by anything, okay, I'll take the second dragon. If we get hit by, you know, any bosses or whatever, that's probably bad. I should probably, like, try and pick up some HP where available. This is all atrocious. Um, a vortex size is pretty decent. Like, we could very easily lose this run. It's not, like... <laughs> it's not uh, an auto win. It's just, um, we've gotten literally everything. Okay, and I'll take X Master Wisdom, because, you know, well, why not? You know? I think the first point of Master Wisdom is good, is where I landed. Um, I'm trying to remember exactly, since it's been... It's been a little bit since I've been, like dove super deep into like the fine details of the game. Um, I think the first point of wisdom was great. Oh my gosh. Um, Fortune is incredible here. Splinter is we have to take Splinter, right? We have. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we have Warp Strike. We have to take Master Splinter. Um, always take Master Splinter. It's like it, the Ninja Turtles rule. So yeah, at some point, our Vortexes are going to get really, really big. But right now, I'm mostly focused on trying to find ways to increase our, our spell area outside of Wintertide. Ways to increase our defense. Um... I can't imagine the bookshelf has anything new. That would be quite a surprise. Um, it would be nice to find magnets um, anywhere. Okay, we'll increase our spell area again. All right, the, the vortex is getting pretty large. I'd say, I guess we'll take spell speeds here. Um, this is an outrageous run. Level 18 at 343, 344. What does time got for us here? This is, this is no good. Let's banish warp strike and reroll here. Um, uh, alteration ritual goes pretty hard. It's not so much about that, like we're just trying to make black hole like really like, the main goal was to make black hole just as large as possible. But in addition, I wouldn't mind having meteors that just like cover the screen as well. You know, blot out the sun with meteors and all that. Back when uh, Michael Bay could direct them. That, was that Michael Bay? Was 300 Michael Bay? I feel like it was. I don't know. I'm having a moment where I can't remember. Either way, um, let's take Wintertide up for a um, bigger area. Also, if you hadn't noticed, Wintertide affects Dragon Breath. Um, and this is also a pretty big synergy with the inscription staff for extra area. So our spell area currently is 323, which is pretty large, you'd say. Um, another meteor shower isn't terrible. I think we're supposed to take combust here for hilarity's sake. The joke being that the combust uh, animation is going to be... Um, large okay so here's the deal i want some defense i want some hp or some evasion or something and we totally missed it so i guess we're gonna take splinter here some vitality any, anything there would have been fine by me but we didn't get it Um, in this gear setup, you know, we're set up to find <laughs> crazy stuff. Uh, yeah, I'll go to six projectiles. That seems good. Um, you know, it's set up to get a bunch of XP and get as much offers as possible and have a lot of dice, which is fantastic. The downside, of course, being that our defenses are mm, non-existent. Ooh, chill to the bone. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I 
How how funny. How funny. So yeah, I mean like I was gonna do the Vortex Winter one and I was like I was re-rolling to start to try and find it, but it wasn't happening. I mean, I, w I was just going to keep rerolling, and then I saw Gehenna Taste of Time, and I was like, okay, we can just do that, right? You know, I'll make a video on that. Um, it's a pretty good start. You can make something fun out of that. Uh, yeah, there's Combust going off. And um, instead, we just get it all. There's Summoner. Is it early enough? Probably. We definitely want time field. I prefer. I think I prefer. To get a higher level time field. Man, having all these warp strike attacks is pretty good. Oh, temporal lord. Cool. So now if we, you know, if we die, we have some safety. We could also cash it in at the end of the run for extra XP if we want to go for something like ridiculous. We'll see. I'm a little concerned that the dragons might solo Dracula. Here. Also, I want to point out that this is a non-mort run. For the record. And meteors <laughs> are actually doing things. Uh, hey, Shatter. That one's pretty good. Fortunately, we can't get Malady unless we roll into it from Alteration. Uh, Shatter plus Malady is a... It, it's, it's one of the ways you, like, kind of break the game by just having instant... Every monster instantly die off screen. Um, it's how Fluffy gets his, like, 30k kills. If you don't know who Fluffy is, I'll, like, put a... I'll, I'll put a tag to, like, his channel on the... on the screen or something right now. Uh, he's big in the Discord. Uh, about like doing degenerate stuff in this game. He makes YouTube videos, not like commentary, but just like clips of absolute broken stuff. Pretty cool. We should go check out his YouTube channel. Highly recommend. He's also a pretty chill guy. All right, let's not die to let's not die to dragons here. Oh, that's right. We have we have vortex. Oh, we have a black hole. It's so awkward trying to dash against me when uh when uh, I have black holes, huh? This <laughs> is so stupid. I'm going to reroll here. Oh, world freeze. Cool. That's nice. Um, This is a run. You know, Blight's not bad. I'll take a Blight. We have extra spell projectiles. I still feel like I would like some more max HP. Right? Like, we're at 48, and it feels pretty unsafe. Pretty unsafe, honestly. Um, summoner to Expert is okay. We haven't gotten Gym High yet, which is weird. Let's take Wisdom 2. It's fine. Kill mortals, he says. Um, I'm going to take Adept Offers. We only have 51 HP, so like... I feel like that's like not a thing. Imagine if we had infinite pull range right now. Take force here. Doesn't seem terrible. Not master force, which is you know a little weaker. Oh, he got a magnet. That's that's nice. I'll take a spell projectile. Um, vortex go up. Bigger black holes. I like it. I see, every time I say black holes, I, so I've been listening to Ginger a lot lately. Um, I'm going to keep hearing that song, I Speak Astronomy, which is pretty good if you're into that sort of thing. Uh, it's definitely not for everyone, but if you like progressive metal, but like some screaming, like, then you might be into it. It's Ginger with the J. I do recommend. Um, hmm. Do we Icebound here or Thaw? Or we just take Blight for an extra one? Like, 
feel like this is the type of run where we should just be going for master everything. So if they're not giving us master offers, we just eh, be a little bit careful here. All right, Vortex 5. So now we get, um, yeah, that's, that's pretty big. I think we could do better, though. We need some shrine luck. Not, okay, game. We need some, we need some shrines that increase our spell area, not shrines that increase our actual luck. I appreciate the joke, though. Um, master off? No, just give me the damage up. Getting extra projectiles on Blight just seems really good. The only downside right now is really just not having infinite bull range. Honestly, I don't think it would be fair to complain, though. I think anyone seeing this run who hasn't put in over 100 hours in this game would be like, what is actually happening? Because it is pretty degenerate right now. I don't even know why I'm picking up equipment, to be honest. Like, with the new update coming out, like, uh, tier 2 items are gonna stomp over tier 1. Ooh! <laughs> um, honestly, give me spell duration. We have alteration ritual. It makes sense. Look at the little leprechaun. We even got a little leprechaun. Little leprechaun luck. Little St. Patrick's Day leprechaun luck. I'm definitely not recording this on St. Patrick's Day, so, you know, whatever, but I'll take it. We're like within a week. Fine. <laughs> the screen is just exploding. Um. Big Fury. These things all kind of suck. We'll banish Curiosity because it does literally nothing. Um, that's like some weird info for the game right now. With the update looming that will assumedly fix it. Uh, obviously take this with, you know, that in mind. But um, pickup drops do at at current with before prior to update literally nothing. So they it should not be taken or geared for or, you know, anything like that. However, within about probably two weeks from this video coming out, that's going to change. So, you know, it's kind of weird. I don't know if they're going to remove pickup drops as a stat or if they're going to like just fix it to work. Who knows? Certainly not I, but um, yeah, it doesn't really matter. I don't really like any of these. Plus, we rolled into fortune, I think. I guess we could do a wisdom here. I don't, <laughs> I don't know. Bonfire is nice. Bonfire is pretty nice. I need a magnet shrine. I need some spell area shrines. And um, yeah, it's about I, I don't I don't need anything. Let's be real here. Pretty sure this build rocks through uh, Dracula pretty easily. Need a light. Need a light. Um, we'll get vehemence, sure. Look at that black hole. Oh, Horfrost? Yeah. <laughs> All right, damage go up. Burning plus f slow. Everyone wants to talk down about summer and winter builds, but, uh, I mean, you see what's happening on the screen right now.
This is certainly a uh, a run of the game. Uh, I'll go alteration ritual, I think, over deadlock. I'm not actually sure the math on which one's better, and I'm not going to take the time to do it right now because it's not really worth it. Oh, Vigor is an easy pickup. Even if it is like trash level one Vigor, um, just getting that puts it in our pool. Um, oh, <laughs> Frost Ring. Uh, Frost Ring is going to have a pretty decent area too. Look at the screen. All right, um, I can roll here. Yeah, it puts so that's the joke, right? It puts it in our pool, so we're more likely to see things that we already have. Uh, so that means I can get more of it. Basically, the whole the whole thing I'm worried about with. Um, the HP situation was just getting one shot by a random attack. That's all. I don't really think that would happen with, um, press the wrong button. Well, there's a chance. Oh, look, pickups. That thing. Oh, pull area, enemy barriers. Take XP per second, I guess. Imagine, imagine with infinite pull range what this run would have done. Oh, well, that's fine. Uh, yeah, let's make frost ring bigger. What if it was just the whole screen? <laughs> okay, it is uh, blight. Oh, we're out of our fortune, our, our alteration ritual buff wore off. So now we're out of dice. Unfortunate. This is at thirteen forty seven. Swan. And we're virtuous by the swan. Oh, man. Sometimes it's do we do we dare run it back? <laughs> OK, OK, um, let's not let's not fumble at the goal line here. I don't even know where the necromancer is. I'll be honest, I can't see anything. This is a mess. Fired up. Uh, oh, this sucks. Uh, incineration's OK. Combust is funny. Doesn't really do anything. It does slightly more than that pickup orb, but you know, it's fine. The dragons really aren't making it easy to see or do really anything. I guess we'll upgrade meteor shower now. I don't know. Bonfire. Hooray. The 72 HP, it's not bad. Who's next? Um, instantaneous straw hat of avalanche. Luffy's straw hat after he joined is um eco terrorist cell in midgard midgar not midgard that is where thor resides not <laughs> not that place in final fantasy 7 um yeah this is pretty good we still you know what's crazy for all the luck we've had no, um, spell area shrines. It's kind of weird. I guess we're 
like not moving around that much either. All right, vehemence goes up to five. That seems acceptable. I mean, our XP has slowed down a lot, which is kind of expected. Without having infinite pull range, it's kind of hard to, you know, have either having infinite pull range or cool off going for your like sprinting around the map. We don't really have move speed either. I mean, we. <laughs> All of these are completely broken. We don't really need frozen treasure. Yes, let's take thought. The problem is everything just dies. Uh, let's take Icebound. It's better against bosses. If we stay inside of our time bubble, which is in fact the entire area, we will be better off uh, during this relatively dangerous portion of the game. That's an unexciting level. Hey, we get an extra meteor. You know, Path of Frost? Uh, a single level of Path of Frost, even at Novice, basically the same as Path of Frost Master here. Effectively the same stats. <laughs> with the extra duration and AOE that we already have. Functionally the same. Things are happening. Things are happening on the screen. Yep, more meteors seems good. So what we could try and do if we want to get fancy and I probably am since why not like if we loot if we you know if something happens and we you know fail like, whatever um, is get Dracula to unalive us at 20 minutes so that we can come back to life and replay the um, the 19 minute mark to bump up our XP gain. We'll have to see how that goes, but um, that's the general strategy. All right, I take Master Thaw too. Why, you know what, why not? Why not take it? It feels like we have everything else. Oh good, a Mind Spring. Um, okay, Blight. Casting faster is pretty decent. What are we actually missing here? Are we missing anything? Are any of our skills like not? I was gonna say, like, has Pandemonium leveled everything up by now? But not really. I hadn't checked, so I wasn't sure. It's funny, we just got our Divine Shield popped by a Frost Arrow. Oh, our vine shield's back. That was really quick. Stone of collection. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh, hey, Jim. Hi. That's crazy. I think <laughs> it's crazy that we haven't had it till just now. Um, it's been one of the downsides. No, no, I'll let that let that be alone here. And then there's a kobold too. Not that we really need gold, but you know, whatever. Uh, game's gonna lag now, probably. Ow, got hit for a lot. I can't really see. Mm, yeah, it's lagging. <laughs> Meteor shower up. Yeah, it's gonna happen faster now. Oh, it's, it's lagging bad. It's bad. Uh, also, <sighs> You know, what sucks here is that because of necromancy, I don't think 
Dracula is going to survive. There's a chance that because we have low HP, if he dashes first, he gets us. But I think what's most likely to happen is that he gets absolutely run over. I want to pick that up. Um, it might be good. <laughs> this screen is dumb. Uh, I think it's more likely. Oh, we got level 69. Nice. Level 69. We're not quite level 69. All right, Dracula, I need you to I need you to hit me. Um, give me this. Come on. I'm I'm like almost dead here. Almost dead. Oh, we got it. We got the reset. Oh, I didn't know his stuff persisted. Let's run it back. Uh, let's try not to die here. Okay, so we get the 19 minute mark again. Which is all the skeleton buddies. Now, obviously, we didn't get that much XP from it, so we're not going to hit, like, the 80s in this run. Um, mostly, again, I think that's due to not having either movement speed or, you know, we didn't have gym high for most of this run, somehow. Just a little carry away with everything else, but, uh, yeah, not really necessary. The whole point was that big area stuff. I guess we should look at what Vortex does. Like, the black hole is pretty big it's not as big as i would had hoped it would be but honestly not too bad time field definitely covers the whole screen though so that's pretty cool all right let's uh run it back dracula where you at i have no idea i he's in there somewhere yeah i think i think he's dead i don't know i can't see anything straight up can't see anything Cool, we won. <laughs> that was so stupid. Oh, let's take these things. I don't know if they're any good. It doesn't really matter. Again, new gear is coming out soon. This should, at least we've been alluded to that it's going to be better than tier one. So and to that point that new, new gear doesn't really matter. Um, This is a end screen for sure. With 32k enemies defeated with, um, for the record, that's <laughs> without Mort. So. No, um, Malady, which is kind of impressive. Double Dragon, Inferno, Taste of Time. Combust has the top DPS and we got it at 254. Yeah, and it's level two common. Just want to just, you know, level two common. Uh, now, uh, that's probably almost entirely because of double 19 minutes. But, you know. Anyways, that was fun. I had a good time. I hope you guys had a good time, too. We're going to just look over the loot here, see if anything spicy dropped. Uh, typically not. Um, th there's a couple things you could still get that would be worth it, but. The odds of that are extremely low. Anyways, if you like this video and you're looking forward to see more, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. There's a ton of content for this game coming on the update on this channel. Uh, plan to be the main source of that on YouTube. So, yeah, hit that notification bell. Uh, thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a great day, Jeff out. Bye.